Hey, it's Joe Glines. And a few days ago, I demonstrated a script um, that allowed just for sending paste instead of sending keystrokes and, and if there were some funky characters in there. Um, someone had commented on Reddit, and I forget who it was. Sorry, I don't mean to uh, not cite you, but um, they gave us a link, uh, me a link to this. But um, I found a different version that worked just slightly better. So I chose to, to put it in here instead. It's from, from G's wig. It's just slightly different. I think the, if I remember correctly, this was not in the, the code that the other person gave me. Um, again, no discredit to them, but um, it's pretty cool. Uh, you, you're using a send message. So there's, um, you know, post and send messages. This is a thing that, that um, with auto hotkey and, and people, you know, they'll, they'll post a simple question. Hey, how do I do this? And, um, and unfortunately, not unfortunately, but um, there's so many different ways you can do stuff, um, especially with AutoHotKey. And it just depends, right? What type of window are you connecting to? So in this example, instead of doing everything I did before where I was prepending some stuff to it, um, I just want to demonstrate if I actually come down here and I click my hotkey, it's going to put this clipboard. Um, I, I only, I'm going to copy this to the clipboard first. So clip the word clip save is now on my clipboard. I'm going to back it up. Then I'm going to put this is from my script in the clipboard and I'm gonna send, it's gonna actually activate it, look for what window's there. It's gonna send, use a send message to send this paste command for lack of better term message, I think I should be saying, um, to that window. Um, and, and I think you can do it to a window and possibly to a control on a given window if I remember right. Um, you gotta add some extra parameters for that. Um, then I'm going to sleep and I'm going to restore the clipboard. I don't think I necessarily need this sleep, but uh, because the other one, we do need it in the other version um, because I was hitting control V, but in this one, I'm not so sure I need it, but I'm going to leave it here anyway and I'm going to restore the clipboard. So the interesting part is like I'm in Auto Hockey Studio right now. I'm going to hit my hotkey. Oh, and, and, and it worked. I thought it actually didn't work in here. Um, maybe I, let me try it again. It still works. Okay, it works there. It works here. Right, so it works in both of those, but look, if I bring up site, it doesn't work at all, right? Um, basically, you can look for edit windows, like actually, if, let me see if I come in here, um, let's do a fine, maybe this window, no, I thought it would have worked in that one. Uh, but if we go over to, to WordPad, um, so WordPad, I'm gonna hit my hotkey, bam. Oh, also notice when I hit paste, notice the clip save is still there, right? That's because I keep backing it up, restoring it, and putting it back in. Um, so here, or I can come up into here and... Oh, interesting, it's not working here. I thought it did, I guess, oh, there it goes. Um, and so not uh, not sure why that did sort of work one time and not the others. Um, so WordPad in Word, so I'm hitting it here, it's not working inside Word, um, yet here, again, when I did it in this one, it did work here. So um, let's see if it'll work up. In... Yeah, that would have surprised me if it worked there. Um, but you get the idea, right? So this is one way that um, you can programmatically send a paste to some windows. Um, and that's where it just depends on, on you know, what window you're trying to connect to and what your options are. Um, that sending the actual control V is highly reliable. This one is reliable if the window accepts these send messages. Um, if it doesn't, then obviously you're, you're out and it'd have to go a different route. Um, but uh, just wanted to show is another way you can do this. Uh, it's always good to think of all the different ways. There's, you know, I, th I can think of at least seven different ways to connect to different programs in AutoHotKey. And uh, it's, it's, uh, it's always just a balance of reliability, consistency, speed, um, you know, accuracy. Is it going to be used on multiple computers and different environments? Um, lots of things to consider. So hope that helps. Cheers.